Justin Trudeau isn't part of the problems at Rideau Hall, but the NDP says he must be part of the solution. Will the Prime Minister show leadership and launch an independent investigation? Obviously, every Canadian has the right to a safe, secure workspace free from uh, harassment, and that is extremely important. Extremely important, but Trudeau isn't saying what action, if any, he'll take. It all comes after CBC News reported more than a dozen sources accused the Governor General, Julie Payette, of berating, belittling and publicly humiliating staff. Payette's secretary, Assunta De Lorenzo, is also accused of bullying employees. Definitely Radio Hall needs to look into this very, very carefully. Today, a public silence from Rideau Hall, but a private memo was sent to all employees last night, just hours after CBC's report. De Lorenzo wrote, I want you to know that I, along with the Governor General and the entire management team, am deeply committed to fostering a healthy work environment. We are here to listen and take action in order to keep improving our work environment. Please rise. She told staff to report any complaints, but sources say their issues would be dealt with by the very people they're complaining about. The Privy Council office said it's very concerned about the allegations and will be following up on these reports. A former cabinet minister says the government needs to take action now. This is a minority parliament. This is not simply a symbolic office. This is a hugely important office that has to have the confidence of Canadians. The Prime Minister could have a discussion behind closed doors with Payette to try and resolve this. Payette is the Queen's representative to Canada and Buckingham Palace is aware of CBC's report, but says it's a matter for the Governor General's office to handle. Ashley Burke, CBC News, Ottawa.